kind of with your pre-association thought also, I told you. But a good writing must be with the with the strategy of a strategy of rhetoric. Because you should be aware of the subject matter, you should be aware of the structure, you should be aware of the audience, you should be aware of the time. Okay? And you should be aware of the language presented. If the language is very offensive, if you, you find that bad treatment, you probably discard the paper, discard the equipment. And if you feel that you have been respected as a very valued customer, customer, you will probably go to buy that product. And basically rhetoric is used, rhetoric is used in business. Today, America, America, let me tell you, why did America take computer engineers from our country? You know? Long ago, 20 years ago, or 10 years ago, many computer engineers from Nepal and India and other countries went to America. Why? Yeah, they were developing internet, they were developing <coughs> Google, they were developing Facebook, okay? They were developing Hotmail. Hotmail was bought, bought from Indian inventories, okay? Indian scientists. But they were taking all the computers in engineers. Microsoft, Apple, all these engineers went to America and developed this, the computer world in American, the computer world in American society. And because of because of you know nonsense things, when you have to you have to do so you have to do some download, it will ask pay twenty dollars. Okay, this is not a product actually, but that is an unseen product. Okay, you will download that thing and you will have to pay twenty twenty dollars. And because of that, who became the richest person? Bill Gates, Steve Jobs. Okay. And so many. <laughs> Facebook owner. Okay. They became the they became the richest possible. And to surpass them, they even China. China cannot surpass them. Uh, surpass the American uh, computer owners. Okay? Software owners. But China has attracted the Western capital to its country because of cheap labor. Therefore, China also convinced the Western world that we can provide you cheap labor. You invest here, we can provide you cheap labor. That's a kind of rhetoric. And what rhetoric do you have? If you go to Switzerland, or why in Switzerland a country of prosperity. Why is Switzerland a country of pros prosperity? You know? Because of watches. Because of watches. Radu. Omega. And why is Japan a country of prosperity? Because of Mitsubishi. Because of so many models of cars. Okay, yeah. Why Germany, the country of prosperity? Walsers, cars. Okay? And why is uh, Finland a country of prosperity? Nokia. Yeah, Nokia and other. Why is Korea? Samsung. What? Samsung? Yes, Samsung. Samsung. Samsung product. So, a country can become a prosperous country. A land can become a prosperous land because of one single product. One single product. Okay. So, we also have a lot of possibilities. But what happens when I, well, when I landed at Tulun International Airport, I saw a signboard. Nepal is 
the second test country of the world in one research center. Just outside I came, there was no electricity. There was no electricity, there was no light. Okay, that rhetoric failed. It should remain outside. Second test country in water resources in the world. And there's no one drinking water supply in Kathmandu. And what is, what is the situation of our country? How can we develop? What is the situation? Let's suppose, if somebody asks you, what is your education, how is your educational system in Nepal? What's your answer? Frustrating. What is, how is your healthcare system in Nepal? Frustrating. How is your security system in Nepal? Frustrating. How is your employment system in Nepal? Frustrating. Okay? Today, the word frustrating can develop, can change differently. Very much optimistic. Very much hopeful. Right. We may, we may have to say the country's potential is right. We have been enjoying all these things. So therefore, you should be aware of what you are going to do in your country. What are you going to do in your country? What, what do you want to do? What do you want to study? Let's suppose you say,